My name is Neil Schneider. I'm the managing member of the Schneider Group. And what our company does is we help small businesses with their challenges. We provide solutions to their problems. Where's your cash? That's the most popular question that I have for many of my clients. Where's my cash? Well, they look at their income statement or their profit loss statement. They see that they made a lot of money, but they see that they don't have much cash in the bank. They then say, where's my cash? If I made $50,000 profit and I only have $10,000 in the bank, what happened to the other $40,000? Well, I try to explain to the client that all the cash that you spend doesn't necessarily appear on the profit loss statement. So we go back to the other financial statement. It's called the balance sheet. Well, the balance sheet has all of your assets on it, all the debt that you owe, and the difference between your assets and the debt that you owe happens to be what the company is worth. So let's take an example. So let's say a company has $50,000 worth of profit and all of a sudden goes out and buys $5,000 worth of furniture and equipment. Well, the $5,000 does not appear on the profit loss statement, but only appears on the balance sheet as an increase in the value of the company. Consequently, you have $5,000 less cash than you have in profit. Another example of that is if you go out and get a loan for $10,000, what happens is only the interest of that loan appears on the, on the profit loss statement as an expense. But the payback of the loan, the principal of that loan, only reduces the debt on the balance sheet, but yet it costs you $10,000 in cash to pay it back. Another example is that if in fact you go out and you spend some money to, to buy uh, or take out cash from the business, such as a distribution, we call it, to the owners of the business, that cash that you take out reduces the amount of cash in your checkbook, but it does not reduce the amount of profit. So with these three different examples, you can see why your checkbook doesn't always equal the profit loss of the net profit or loss on your financial statement.